Here's a super quick way to remember sine and cos values. So we're gonna write 0, 30, 45, 60, and 90. Then inside the grid, you're gonna write on the top row, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. And then on the bottom, you're gonna do the reverse, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Now say you want sine 30. All you have to do is go to the sine row. So we want sine and 30. So that's gonna be the square root of one divided by two. And simplifying that, the square root of one is just one, so it's a half. Cos 45, well, we go to the cos row, cos 45. So it's the square root of two over two. Sine 60, we go to the sine row and the 60 column, Sine 60 is the square root of 3 over 2. How about cos 0? Well, then we've got the square root of 4 over 2. We can simplify that. The square root of 4 is just 2, and so that's just 1. So this is a great way to remember these values if you need them in an exam. Just remember this diagram, draw it in the corner of your exam paper, and you're good to go.